Hello, 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 everybody. Welcome back to Just Shy. I am Shy, the person who lies right to your face <laughs> and not the adjective. <laughs> That was an aggressive opening, um, <laughs> but yeah. So whatever I decide to title this video is is gonna be a lie. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do some unboxing. We have just a couple of albums today, but yes, today is the day that I am finally revealing um, that I have been collecting Kim Taewon for like an entire full calendar year. <laughs> You just didn't know about it. So hello, welcome, <laughs> welcome. I have in fact been collecting Taewon. Um, her binder hasn't even been on my shelf. It's been in my closet. Like it was that deep. <laughs> it was that deep. <laughs> but yeah, I just really love the Seraphim specifically. I love Taewon so much. I mean, I love all of the girlies, but like Taewon is my bias. And Easy, she was like the straw that broke the camel's back. I just absolutely love this comeback so much that I decided that like I do indeed want to like collect her on camera. So today we have my Easy albums. I ordered some things from Japan. I ordered some things from Korea. It was it was truly an assembling to get all this here, but yes. So let's go through all these photo books first. Because some of these, um, I had my Kaati unbox them because I didn't need 57, 11,000 albums. So some of these are album cards and some of these are pops and I don't, I don't want to look at anything yet. So <laughs> let's just go through all the photo books and then we'll look at Weavers and pops and all of that. So yes, let's get to it. Get two of these clear file folders from Japan. I don't know what is up with them and clear file folders. Like Japan, nobody finds this useful. I don't know why they keep doing this, but I got two of them. So that's, that's nice. Okay, so for the first album, we're going to go through all of the Balmy Flex versions. So I did buy one, <laughs> literally just one from Target. I was originally just going to get all three versions from Target and then try to find Taewon's uh, member version. But first of all, my Target only got like 17 Kazuha. And I was like, why? Why? <laughs> Um, and so, and then I saw a couple of unboxings and saw that it was like just a group card and I was like, I'm not feeling it, Target. So that is how I spiraled into ordering from both Korea and Japan to try to get a cute pop and it was, it was a mess. <laughs> okay, so let's open her up. We won't do a full, a whole unboxing. I'm so late as, as one is when you're a shy I'm so late to this so like it has been unboxed you know all it can be unboxed like everybody's seen but still oh okay shoot you really gotta want it Jesus so yeah I'm so excited especially because like this pink version first of all how perfect is this shade of pink like it's just like fading into my desk <laughs> I love it so much. But yeah, one of these is the US um, group card. And then one of these is the Target group card. I genuinely don't know which is which. I was just like, I'm fine with just having, you know, one. I think there might be multiple versions of the Target group card. I don't actually know. But these are the two that I got. And then here is our pool. And I think that was all that was random in these. I think. Oh, look at Jaywon. She's so beautiful. Let me just look real cute, real quick. Just real quick. Let me find. Oh, I love this pink version. No surprise. The pink one's my favorite one. <laughs> okay. 
All right, let me actually open all of these up and just take the pulls out since we're not doing a whole unboxing and then I'll come back to you when we're, we're looking at cards. Okay, I do not envy freaking Seraphim Gomes. Jesus, that was, I got arthritis. <laughs> That's how I'm gonna put that. So yes, I did also manage to get her um, member version. I don't love <laughs> this style, but she is the cutest bean and you know the things that i will do for kim Wan. look at her she's so cute um but yeah this thankfully just had one card and it was like member guaranteed so we did get her member cover card which is so freaking cute <laughs> why would you do this like, I just honestly wish they would have kept the compact consistent because <laughs> now it's going to be a different size than all the other ones. And I'm like, why would you do that? <laughs> These are my pulls from the two Korean stores that I ordered from. I ordered a set from Makestar and that's these. And then I ordered some from Soundwave Music Plant music korea something i literally i don't remember i do remember ordering mig star because it was hollow and then i ordered something else because like there was like oh my god somebody's dogs are fighting size please i swear to god i ordered a set from make star and i ordered a set from something else where like in the blurred preview i saw inklings of pink hair taewon so yes, I ordered five from that store just to like make sure that I would get Chaewon's card. And then Make Star, it was like order a set, get all five members, and I was like, say less. So let's see here. I have not seen any of my pulls. I'm real excited about it. So let's go through Balmy Flex first, which I believe should be these ones. Okay, so like I said, oh god, she just fell right on over. I'm so sorry. Okay, so yeah, like I said, the US and the Target had group cards, which like, their group cards are pretty, so that's why I bought one, but not pretty enough to buy three. <laughs> okay, let's flip these over. Like I said, I collect Chaewon, but I won't be unhappy with anyone. So my first pull is... <gasps> oh, Kazuha! That's my second bias. <laughs> She's my second bias. Like, I really considered collecting OT5 at one point, but, like, K-pop technology has not gotten there. Like, we're not there yet for me to be able to do that because I'm not about that whole horizontal storing thing. I don't like it. Okay. Our second pull. <gasps> oh, this is cute. Oh, this is cute, cute. Ooh. <laughs> Not me regretting immediately saying I'm not collecting OT5. <gasps> oh my gosh. No. Okay, let's not let's not speak about it. Let's let's not. <laughs> because I'm gonna get attached. Alright, let's see what came in my Japanese albums. I don't know if it's front or back or okay, so this is the back. Alright. Okay, let's see. And I also love how like textured these are. Like that's a nice touch anyway okay one two oh my 
got a tube of contacts. Okay, okay. I tend to have pretty good J1 luck, I would say. Like, there were a couple of cards I didn't pull for her, but for the most part, I feel like I've had good luck for her. But anyways, okay, here we go, here we go. <laughs> How? These are from two different countries. <laughs> How? Okay. I wonder if we can even pull a third member. Not right after I said I have good J1 luck, this happens. All right, here we go, here we go. One, two. Okay, I take it back. I should have said nothing. <laughs> I should have said nothing at all. Okay. All right, next we'll do my Featherly Lotus pull. Did I end up with five cards for every single version? <gasps> no, don't do it. No, no, don't do it. Okay, all right. Let's see my first Featherly Lotus pull. It is... <gasps> oh, we got... <laughs> she loves me so much. <laughs> I forgot I'm also Zuha blessed. I pulled her so much during Unforgiven Era. Y'all don't know about that though, because again, <laughs> it was collecting off camera. <laughs> All right, let's see, let's see. <gasps> oh, this Kura card. Oh, this Kura card. Oh, that's so pretty. Seraphim cards are so pretty. That's also a problem. It's also part of the problem not part of the solutions all right and let's see let's see oh we got another one <laughs> okay we're just gonna be kajuha blessed i'm not complaining though all right and our fourth pool <gasps> it's a day oh look how cute she is in the blonde yes let's go She's so cute too. That's my third bias. <laughs> That's my third bias. <laughs> okay. And our last Featherly Lotus. I feel like I'm now, because I said that, I'm going to have to trade for all three versions for Taewon. Anyway, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> yep, we got another good app. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. All right. And now let's look at my sheer merp. So here's the Korean ones. Not that it's making much of a difference. <laughs> All right, one, two. Oh, we seriously pulled Kazuha for all the versions. She's so cute with her big old doll eyes. I just love her so much. I should have just collected Kazuha. I should have. I would have had a good life. All right, and our second pull. <laughs> it's Ante. Look at how cute she is. She also just has really cute cards. Do we have any? Are there any album cards of her and her purple hair? Okay, and our last pull from Korea, that is. <laughs> we got Kura. I literally, literally could have. Okay, I'm going to stop saying it. I'm going to stop saying it. Okay, we have pulled everybody but Taewon. Everybody except for Taewon. Everyone. Every single person. <laughs> It's because I put her on camera. She said, no, mm -mm, I will only come home when nobody can see. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go. We got another Zuha. All right. And our last album card pull is, is another Kura. Not a one, not a one. Okay, Taiwan. I I see. I hear you. Okay. Never mind. Video canceled. She said she would not like to be collected on camera. Okay. So I also bought two of each of the Weavers versions because I I could not even recall which one I actually needed two of because I'm pretty sure one. I'm pretty sure the unit one. You need two because there's two units per member. And then the solo ones, there's just one question mark. <laughs> okay, goodness, they were so hard to friggin' open. But I'm pretty sure these are the two solo ones because it says A version. And then these are the two um, unit ones because it's the B version. So let's see the unit first. <laughs> let's see, let's see. <gasps> 
We got a Taiwan Yoon. Oh my gosh, this is so freaking cute. <laughs> Thank you for finally coming home. I appreciate you. <laughs> okay, and let's see our other unit. Oh, we got Sakura and Yujin. I got both Yunjin units. Okay, come through. Come through. All right. And let's see our solo member ones. Oh, look at this. <laughs> I love everything about this, but I can't be an OT5 collector. I can't. I can't do that. All right. And oh, no, not cute. At I swear to God, she is my weakness. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I got one with Taewon in it. So that's. <laughs> that's what I get honestly for being so petty okay so now we can go through all of the pubs that I bought so I did get two Japanese sets and two Korean sets I only intended on keeping Taewon but like they're so cute so yeah this is I don't even know what Japanese set this is to be honest but here we go Oh, look at how freaking gorgeous, like freaking gorgeous. We got Tuha, and we got Yunjin. Look how freaking cute. <laughs> oh, these cards are so cute. Look at Kura. Oh my gosh. And then my girl. I, when I saw the like little hair bubbles, I was like, I need that one. I need that. That's something I need. <laughs> I need it. And again, I only had to buy three albums to get the full set of five. So that also influenced my decision. <laughs> here's Ente for the second set. And here's Juha. Oh, we got red hair, Yunjin. Oh, okay. And then we got Kura. And then my girl, look at her in this hood. I couldn't resist. I could not resist. These sets are both so pretty. Okay. And then, um, so what had happened was I bought five albums because again I thought I needed to like buy five albums to get all five lucky draws because I guess I'm just traumatized or something but apparently I only needed to buy one set of albums to get all five lucky draws so now I have like a full set and then two extras since I bought like you know the three albums in a set and then two more to make it five so now I ended up with seven lucky draws <laughs> that's what happened Okay, let's see. Oh, we got, we got baby Unte. I love her in this blonde. I don't know where to put baby Unte. Oh, I guess we'll just stack them down here. All right, and we got Yunjin. And again, her with this red hair is um, speaking to me. <laughs> Look at this Kura in this like fluffy pink. I don't even know what that is, jacket? Crop top, something. And then we got Zuha. And then we got an extra Zuha. And then we got freaking pink hair Taewon. <laughs> I just had to have it. I love it. I love it so much. And then I pulled an extra pink hair for again Taewon. So I got an extra Zuha. And Taewon, I don't know what I'm going to do with them, but, like, I got them. And then the last set I got from Make Star. So, like I said, I only had to purchase three albums, and they were, like, get the full set of five, plus, I think, a group card. And I'm, I'm pretty sure these cards are hollow, but I don't really remember. It's been a while. So, oh, this is pretty. This is the group card. So, now we have three group cards. <gasps> they are hollow. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry I'm having a time can you tell can you tell that I'm having a time because I am that is so freaking gorgeous 
Oh, look at Cora. This hair color on her, and especially when she put the like black at the ends, so cute. Oh, and we got this Zuha. She's just so pretty. I just love her. Oh, look at this J1. <laughs> And last but not least, we got Missy Engine. Again, with the red hair. So I think I only have one pop of her not in the red hair. Iconic. Love it. Okay, so this is only half this video. We're also going to go through my Chaewon binder. Um, I expected to store more cards for her, but I literally pulled like two album cards and one of them was guaranteed. So there's that let me just organize all of this and then we'll we'll do that part So we will sleeve her cards real quick. I sleeve her in these uh, Popcorn Games purple sleeves. They're like perfect fit sleeves, which typically I don't like, but since she has her own binder, it, it doesn't bother me nearly as much. So part of the reason that I did not collect her on camera was because I was unsure of like how long I was gonna wanna collect her. Because sometimes I just like want a couple of cards and I don't wanna like start a whole new collection. Um, but I was really just unsure. Like usually I'm pretty sure when I wanna do that, like there have been some cards of idols that I don't collect that I'll just like want a specific card. And so I'll just pick that up. But for like Taewon, I kinda wanted all of her album cards. She got me during Anti-Fragile. They got me during Anti-Fragile. <laughs> song was such a banger. And it's so weird because I did not like that song at all on first listen. But like, I feel like it was like the end of the year music show. I was just like watching everybody's stages. Um, I watched the stages of even groups like I don't stand and things like that. So I was just like watching the stage. And I don't know, something about seeing them perform Anti-Fragile like live just hit and then I like went back and I watched the music video again and I was like what was I thinking this is a banger <laughs> um and like it just spiraled from there so I started like picking up her cards and buying some albums I do believe I bought some albums for like my last year birthday haul as well when I was going through it for Taiwan. <laughs> so it really just spiraled from there and then that was like right before they dropped Unforgiven, which I absolutely loved. And they had cute Yeehaw solo member cards at Target. So I, of course, um, bought a bunch of albums. Scott Chaewon's Yeehaw card. <laughs> so cute. So the envelope goes in a green one. And I don't like sleeving it in a green one because like it sticks out. Like the sleeve sticks out, but I don't mind for the envelopes. But yeah, they got me for Anti-Fragile and then Unforgiven. I absolutely loved and I was like, okay. So I collected her for both of those. <laughs> and like, yeah, I bought some albums for my birthday haul because this, this concept in particular was just so beautiful to me. I was like, I want to own that photo book. So like, yeah, they like got me, but I just really... <laughs> I was just so unsure. I did not know what I wanted to do. But yeah, I've been collecting Taiwan for a full whole calendar year, like a business year <laughs> at this point. And I was like, okay. Um, I don't really collect too many pops for her. Like I collected the Target pop and then this pop and this one for Unforgiven, I think are the only ones because this one's Target, I do believe. I don't remember where this one's from, but it it's so pretty. It's like got this glitter hollow. I don't know if y'all can see it, but it does. It does. And it's beautiful. But yeah, so I am literally completely caught up with her collection. I'm not missing a single thing. Oh, I also collected these Japanese cards. 
Well, but yeah, so let me, mm, I'm still unsure of how I want to like store things for her though. Cause we have some unit stuff down here. So I would love to put her other two units down here. That means I'm gonna need to move. I don't even know what this card is from. I guess this is from Unforgiven Japan, but it's not in the same concept as this one. So, okay. Let's put this one here instead. Um, Do I wanna keep? Because there's gonna be three photo card versions and then one Weaver's version. So I think I wanna put them all here we'll move this unforgiven group card so this is an album no it's not no it's not literally lied to myself this is an album card i'm gonna have so much trading to do somebody please trade me <laughs> just gonna take this time now to say somebody please trade me Okay, this is facing that way, and I can't live my life like that, so you're, you're going to have to change. Okay. This one's, like, way different. We'll just put it over here for now, and then we'll put this one over here. And then... We'll put this last one over here. That makes our group card is a pain in the butt. All right, so we'll, I literally change this every single time they have a comeback. Um, I really don't want this group card here, but we also don't have a better place for it. So <laughs> there's that. But yeah, we're gonna move this to put her other unit card in here at some point. But yeah, I just rearrange this as I go. All right. So then, oh, I have a place. Oh, <laughs> I forgot I just stuck this in here because I didn't have a place for it. Because this binder doesn't have pockets. Like, so I just stuck it in here and I totally forgot until right now. This binder's a mess. We're going to have to start putting the envelopes on the back, too. Eventually, she's going to need a bigger binder, but, like, she's just been living like this for a full year. Because I have the envelopes in the front, and I think I'm also going to put them back here in the back. Okay. So, well, now we have this unforgiven. Randomly. All right. Um obviously pink Chaewon needs to be in the middle that's just so obvious <laughs> and then I think hollow Chaewon also middle and she has brown hair in this one as well so let's put those two together honestly the solution is probably to buy more pops because I know she has at least one more pink hair one and I want it so I might just do a whole, does she have a fourth hair color or was it just like these three? I'll look into it. I'll look into it. This is a messy, a messy collection. So just, yes. And then I guess we'll put Unforgiven Taiwan just down here. Well, she has black hair, so maybe that'll work out. Maybe that'll work out. <laughs> So yes, this is how my Chaewon collection is going. We're missing all of her photo book album cards. I thought I would at least pull one. I had five copies of each version. How? <laughs> oh, but yeah, until we advance in K-pop collector technology to be able to store five pocket like upright. I know Meow Cafe has pages like that, but they're... Um, slim fit size which I hate <laughs> so she needs to go ahead and make that standard if if we're gonna do this but yeah I just love Kim Taewon and look forward to seeing more of her on my channel I guess <laughs> sorry I lied <laughs> all right well 
until the next time I lie straight to your faces about who and what I collect. Bye!